Let's do one side of my face with the dewy makeup look and the other side with the matte makeup look and let's see which one you guys like better. For the dewy side, we're gonna start with my Say Illuminating Serum in shade Star Glow. And I apply this all over my face and I already know I'm gonna like the dewy side better because I am a glazed donut queen. For foundation, we're gonna mix my Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Filter with my Ilia Skin Tint on this side of my face. To blend this out, I'm gonna spray my beauty blender with my Charlotte Tilbury Setting Spray. I zoomed in so you guys can see, but um, just look at that glow. For concealer, I'm taking my YSL Touche Eclat Concealer. This is really great for brightening. And I'm just going back in with my Beauty Blender to blend out, which I normally never do. For bronzer, I'm going to take my Makeup by Mario Skin Perfector. I'm also just bringing some leftover onto my eye. Now we're going to go in with the Makeup by Mario Skin Perfector and put that on the areas that we just put our bronzer. Then we're going to take our Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Powder and put that on the areas that we didn't put the bronzer. Now for blush, I'm going to mix my Illuminator by Rare Beauty with my Revolution Blush. Made this little concoction on my hand. We're just going to mix that up and dab away. Look at that glowy peachy color we just made. Now let's fill in the brows normally. Let's go in with my Bougie Tom Ford palette and let's start with this coppery brown color in my crease. And I'm going to drag the color out to elongate my eyes. Now we're going to go in with this gold champagne color on my lid and inner corner. We're also going to add some on the brow bone. And lastly, we're going to take this plum color and just run that along my lower lash line to create the illusion of eyeliner. And lastly, we're going to take some Giorgio Armani eye paint and just add that on that gold and tap it out with our fingers. Lining the lips with Rare Beauty Humble. Topped with my pink lip oil. Okay, do we? Now let's do the matte side. Let's start off with my REM Blurring Primer. Now let's go in with my Baz Matte Foundation Six. This is literally my exact skin tone. You didn't even see that go on. Let's go in with my matte concealer to conceal any areas that we might need. Powder, we're going in with our MAC Studio Fix all over the face. For bronzer, we're taking our L'Oreal Infallible Soft Matte Finish. For blush, let's go in with my Dior 001. And the brows as normal. Let's go in with some Hoola Bronzer in my crease. I'm gonna go in with this bone color on my lid and brow bone. Let's take this matte dark brown slash purple and run that along my lash line. For lips, I'm taking my Makeup Forever lip liner in shade whatever walnut. And then we're gonna take this Makeup Forever lipstick in shade Endlessly Blushed. Now the lip dries, let's set this side of my face with my Givenchy powder. Okay, this is the glowy side of my face. And this is the matte side of my face. I will say close up, the glowy side looks way more skin-like. Meanwhile, this side, definitely you can see the powder loaded on my face. Which side do you guys like better? 